Previously on Pokemon Sword We're not going anywhere Dry fried food curry, wow Hmm, Kindred no likes it Level 36, anyway. Final evolution of our starter Pokemon. What's her name? Rilla Boom. Hmm. Hello YouTube, welcome to the continuation of our episode for Pokemon Sword. So we have finally arrived in Stone Side. First and foremost, we are going to explore the town first. Also I saw a stadium. So there may be a gym battle here. We will see later. For now, let's talk with everyone in the town. See what's up. See if we can buy anything. Rock pot. Hmm, what is that? Well, we have 64,000. I don't know what. I don't know what's this. What's the use of this one? A peculiar teapot that can make a certain species of Pokemon evolve. Maybe cracked, but tea poured from it is delicious. Hmm, messy. Wait, what's the next bargain? Going to get the Miracle Seed. Mark, you already have Miracle Seed? Hmm, an errand. I'm buying a bag of star, that's for 4,000. Sure. At least we got that money back. Hmm. It's a bronzong. Is that safe? <laughs> I meant to talk to the kids, not to the diglet. You wanna wear bronzong on your head? Are you sure about that? <laughs> can squeeze you, you know? Bronzong can squeeze you. Anything here? Nothing. Hmm. What's this? Oh. Hello, Diglets. What are you doing there? Hmm. There's an item here. X special attacks. So a ladder here. What's in here? What can we find here? Rooftop? Oh yeah, there's a gym here. And there's a TM! Wait. Wonder for what move that is. Hmm. Hello, mister. Hey there, you happen to catch a lot of Maractus? How about trading one for my Hatina? You already have Hatina. Hmm, or perhaps... Got another metal coat. Or perhaps it... Is Athena is holding something valuable? I don't know. Hmm. Where's our Maractus? Let's see. Yeah. Feel free to have this Maractus. Although I already have a. I already have a Hatina, so... Hmm. So is there anything special about your Maractus? Hmm, it's not holding any item. It's basically the same as mine. Well, anyway. At least we helped you. Venoshock! Deals double the damage when your target is poisoned. Down we go. Time to interact with Hop. Let's see if, let's see if Hop is okay now.
Hmm, still not doing okay, I guess. Still down? Feeling down? But the only thing I can do is get stronger, right? I'm gonna try out all kinds of different things against you and see what works. Hmm. Who's in front of my party? Hold on. Just let me check who's in front of my party up. I'm not turning down a barrel. Orbis Squire, level 30. Hmm. Minimal since we battled with Corby Squire. Maybe we can set up with Hone Claws or so on. Well, let's see. Do we have battle animation on? Okay. We're all set. Just chill, hop. So how many Pokemon do you have now? Four, okay. Cramorant. Water water flying type. Hmm, level twenty-eight. That's below from what I was expecting. I think we can set up Hone Claw. Let's try increasing Corvi, Corvi Square attacks as much as possible. Dive. Hmm. All right, this Pokemon has that specific ability. Wherein, if it uses Dive or Surf, it will grab a fish or something. Ah, uh, that's bad. Hmm. Forty eighty-two. I think it's time we... Oh, it's faster? Come on, Corby Squire. We're just gonna faint just like that? Okay, so... Why was it faster? Quick Lock? 1 HP. Come on now. Can you faint him in one attack? Okay, good. And you also faint. <laughs> GG. Not bad. Not a bad battle, Corvus 4. Hmm. 33. Hatina. Let's send out Dredna. Toxio. Hmm. Electric type. We'll take you on. I think we can use Crunch. Let's maximize Tough Jaw. Good job. But it paralyzed Dredno, unfortunately. But that's okay. That's okay. He's slow anyway. Silly Cobra? Oh, that Pokemon! Hmm. That Pokemon, that Team Yell didn't want me to disturb earlier. Not sure what this... what its type is. Probably poison? Hmm, let's use crunch. Let's try it. Brutal swing. Dark type? Nope, not dark type. I think Dredno can sweep. Paralyzed. Dig. Okay, Crunch is gonna miss for this turn. Why are you thinking about camping? We are still in the middle of battle, Dreadnought. <laughs> That's super effective. Hmm. Okay, great job, Hop. That's that's not gonna be enough. You did good. You did good, man. Let me see your starter Pokemon. 
so much close to evolving. So close. Sucker Punch. Hmm. You see, you have Sucker Punch. Still paralyzed. Round. Hmm. That's gonna hit Dreadnought's lower defense stat. Which is special defense. Okay, one more crunch should finish it. As long as it can move. Nice. Great job. Wait, was that a critical hit? <laughs> Didn't see. The strategy goes right to part when I've got all these bad thoughts running through my head. Need to move need to move forward now, Hop. I think you're focusing too much on your big bro. Hmm. Gotta believe in yourself more. No, Opal! <laughs> surprise, surprise! Team challengers should battle for the sake of their own Pokemon. Why worry about saving the champion's name? We all know he's unbeatable, you know, right? Anyway, here's something for letting me watch your battle. Oh, BS League card. The gym leader here. Team challenge is about having fun. Do you want me to assist you? Are you sure you can take the stairs? <laughs> and she disappeared. Anyway, I think we are going straight to the gym. So let's see. Let's see who we will be taking against the gym leader. Okay. As far as I know, that gym is that that gym specializes on fighting type Pokemon. So, Sturdock is okay, or Beetle would do fine. Psychic type, Coughing would do would do fine, since he can cripple a lot of fighting types. Not to mention, majority of fighting type Pokemon focuses on attack stat. We have Willow Wisp and Coughing's relatively high defense stat. Athena, Psychic type. Corvus Squire fighting type. Kindred no. Not really sure if Kindred no is a good a good Pokemon to include here, but hmm. I don't really want to include Grod yet. Already level 35. I feel like I'm just going to overpower that gym. Berserker he is weak against fighting type, but he has high defense stat. Just let's just go with this with this team. Let's go with this team. But before that, let's check if we have enough supply of revive and super potion. Six. So let's buy four. And then revive four. Let's buy one. Nah, actually never mind. I don't think we will be needing revive. Let's go. We'll just reserve Corby Square. Let's use Sir Doc. Fight fighting with fighting type Pokemon. Oh wait. I saw a ladder here. Be there's No Diglet. There's an item here. Rock pot. So much for buying that one. Hmm, what's this? Hmm, is there anything here? What is this? Hey, okay. Some Pokemon live in the mountains, some Pokemon live in the forests. So many different species. So where does this lead to?
Oh, Gleamwood Tango. Nah. Let's take on the gym for now. Or how about this one? Where does this lead to? We're going really high, huh? Mountain? What do we have here? Stone side famous mural said to be a very deep work of art. Okay, I am expecting to meet Sonia there later. I'm sure she's gonna be there after this gym battle. Let's head to the gym. No, Mr. Pokeball guy. Heavy ball. For Snorlax. <laughs> Yep, we're still going strong. Oh, hello! I think that used to be a blip bug. I think we're all set. Hmm, double check. Is our lineup okay? Corby Square, or Beetle, Coughing. Hmm. Perhaps we should try Grod and sub Kindred. No, 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 no. Let's go with it. I think this team will do just fine. Now let's see what's going to be the gym mission. Fighting type gym. What could be the gym mission? Oh, that's a lot of steam below. Pinball? Reminds me of pinball. This is a really big stadium. To complete the mission, you'll need to ride in one of these cops and make your way to the goal while trying to avoid obstacles. Make your way to the goal while trying to avoid obstacles. Let me tell you a bit more about how to operate this fat attraction. Take your control stick to the right and the cup will start to spin to the right. Take to the left to make the cup spin to the left, okay. Hmm, free the wall, rotate the stick as quick as you can to get yourself out of that sticky situation. Okay, let's try it. Spin to win! Um, what? Okay. Oh, wait. Okay, okay. Okay, I get it now. Hmm, good. <clears throat> and we have a Pokemon battle. Let's go, Kindred, no. Take those fighting type Pokemon. Take on those fighting type Pokemon. Stuffle. Gonna use Crunch. No, not Crunch. Raise your shell. Why are you thinking about camping? We are in the middle of battle. Focus on the battle. Nice. Critical hit. Good job. Corby Square is now level 31. Oh boy. That's... Hmm. Let's see what... Move is gonna use. To protect. Protect for the meantime. Mm. Brutal swing. Dark type move? Okay. Guess we're safe. Let's keep on fighting. Using Kindred now. Defense fell. Good, good, good. Take down. That's not going to be very effective. Still, quite a lot of damage from Beware. 
think this Pokemon has an insane attack stat similar to Gyarados Surfetch. Great job, Kindred, no? Okay, Coughing. Coughing is now level 34. So we're gonna maximize that amulet coin to get a lot of... what's this? Hmm. No. Not gonna go to that one. I have a feeling it's going to take me back to the starting point. Hmm. Oops, oops, oops. Oh, okay. So there's nothing here. Uh huh. Okay, let's go here. Go here and then here to the right side. Rightmost. Uh, go left, go left, go left. Nice. Great job. Another battle. Let me restore Dreadnought's HP. I'm gonna keep on fighting using Dreadnought. Hello there. Is your gym mission supposed to be Enchanted Kingdom? Farfetched. Okay. I really like the design of Galarian Farfetched, to be honest. This Farfetched looks intimidating. Hmm, detect. Nice. Scouting out my move. I only have Razor Shell to use against you. Detect again? Do you want me to run out of power points? At this point, I won't be able to use Kindred no later. Hmm. Sand attack. You're hoping to make me miss my next attack, huh? You scrunch. Attack again! I don't see the point. You just want me to move it. You just want me to waste my PP. My power points. Razor shell power points. Oh crap, Rock Smash. Completely forgot about Rock Smash. Avoided the attack! That's not good. Oh ho ho ho, that's not good. No good. Let's bring out Athena. Uh, actually, no. That Farfetch may have Brutal Swing. Sir Duck, Corby Squire. Let's bring out Corby Squire. Wonder what level is this Pokemon going to evolve? To Corby Knight. That's not gonna be very effective. Line type. Block. Detect again. Come on. Again? Don't tell me you're gonna use the tech again. <laughs> so do you have another Pokemon? Nope. Anyway, you did a great job, Kindred. No, you you just you just chill here. <laughs> tut, tut, tut. Whoops! 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 Not there. Mhm. Mm okay. Uh. Nope. Need to use this. 
Oh, okay. It's not enough. We need to go to the left most. Then go right all the way. Right all the way. Then left. Left, left, left. What? Okay. So I went directly here. Another trainer. Corby Square. Yeah, let's battle with Corby Square. Reckless Gym Challengers? I'm not reckless. Hitmon Lee! So what level is that Hitmon Lee? Level 33. Two Pokemon. You have two Pokemon. Let's use Hone Claws first. Corby Square is... Outleveled revenge. Hmm. Okay, I think we can use one more Hone Gloss so that we can sweep until the second Pokemon. Luck should be able to one hit them. Hopefully, hopefully. First, I know Hitmon should have low defense. Okay, good. Hitmon Chan has a higher defense stat versus Hitmon Lee. Athena, Athena now level 30. Okay. Sir Dak also now level 34. Corby Squire 32. Dazzling Gleam. Fair type move. 80. Oh, Hitmon Chan. As I was saying. Hmm, this one may have Thunder Punch. So we need to take this guy in one hit. To take this guy down in one hit. Hopefully, Black will do it. Hmm, Bullet Punch. Okay, good job, Corby Square. Finish him off. Almost fainted. <laughs> Great job, Corby Squire. Okay, this is now gonna be the gym leader. So let's restore the HP of our party. Hmm, Kindred, no. Yeah, that should be enough. And then. Corby Squire has Sharp Beak. I'm thinking of using Kindred now. Actually, let's use. Let's see how difficult Bea would be. Not to mention, Dreadnought is holding my amulet coin. So if we win against. B if we win against Beya, it would she would give us double the amount, double the, double the amount of money. We'll switch if we need to. Welcome, Gym Challenger. I'm Beya. Do you have an unshakable spirit that won't be moved, no matter how you are attacked? I think I'll just test that out, shall I? Who's going to be her first Pokemon? Let's see. Ultra Ball. She has four Pokemon. Hitmon Top. Hmm. Hitmon Top, Hitmon Lee, Hitmon Chan, Machamp. I wonder. Level 34. This is gonna be a tough battle. Let's see. Let's see what move she's gonna use. Counter. I see now. Hmm. Counter. Crunch Rock Tomb. Two Crunch. 
hope its defense fell. Or rather fall. Oh, never mind. It used revenge instead. That's bad. Well. Hmm, interesting. Sir Doc. Hmm, or Beetle. It uses counter and revenge. Let's do it. We let's do it. Coughing. People, damn enemies. Let's see how you will deal against my coughing. Hmm, revenge. That's gonna deal a little damage. Poison type resists fighting type. And coughing is quite bulky. Defense wise. Plus, you've got a burning hit on top. Perfect time for Sludge Bomb. Revenge again. And perhaps this is a good opportunity to set up. To set up Farfetch. Should we? Set up with Focus Sash and then. Not Focus Sash, I mean Focus Energy. Mm, yeah. Let's stick with Coughing. I'm going to let Coughing take care of this. Without that burn status, Revenge would actually deal quite hefty damage against Coughing. Clear smog. This is clear smog. This would be enough. Be enough to finish it off. You have to save power points for Sludge Bomb. Okay, that's one Pokemon down. Great job, coughing. You're doing great. You're doing great. Hmm, Pangoro? Fighting type. Let's use Willow Wisp. Work up. Hmm. Let's see what you're planning to do now. Good job. You must always hit Willow Wisp. So you want. So you're gonna try and set up in front of Coughing. That's no good. I won't let that happen. And let's use Sludge Bomb. Hmm, gonna keep on using Night Slash. This Pokemon fighting type and dark type. If you plan on using Night Slash more, I think it's time I send I send out Sir Doc. I think it's not feeling so great too. Oh, Mold Breaker. Okay. Let's see how well you do against our Doc. Night Slash again. It's gonna deal a little damage. Okay. Focus the energy first to guarantee critical hits. Circle Throw. Fighting type move. Okay. Wait, what? Are you sure about that? Are you sure about what you are doing, Bea? You just made a grave mistake. You just made a mistake. Are you gonna do circle throw again? Oh, night slash. Didn't want to deal against. 
Hits or duck, huh? Hmm. One more hold loss. Wait, I think outspeeds me. Oh no, okay. We messed up. We messed up badly. Hmm. Coughing now level 35, Corbis Bar 33, or Beetle 35. Oh, nice. You also have Sir Fetch. Interesting. Mm, I, keep, I think we can do one more Horn Claws. Or is she going to try and set up? Let's do Horn Claws. Mm, nice job. Use the tech while I set up myself. That's two stages up for, for Corby Squire's attack. I'm to use Clock. Hmm, critical. Oh boy. Need to sweep it now. Rather, we need to feint it now. Hmm. This is on you, Bea. This is on you. Because you, s you forced me to send out my Corby Squire. Level 36 matchup. Interesting. She's so gonna Dynamax this one. Hmm. Go all out. Began to maxing. Wait. Do you mean Machamp has a different form? Oh wow! Is that Machamp looks different? Yes, indeed, a different form. Hmm. Well, <laughs> half damage. Max strike. Hmm. Is that gonna faint? Corby Square. Oh, that fainted him. Good job, Corby Square. Don't worry about it. Hmm. Let's see how will you do against her, Doc. Why are you thinking about camping, Sir Doc? We're in the middle of a fight. With Dynamax, Max Guard. Hmm. This moving name to use protect itself from all attacks. Hmm. Max Knuckle, 70. I think we can only use Max Knuckle. Or should we go for Max Guard? Still has two turns. Nah, let's go with let's go straight to Max Knuckle. Time to Dynamax Sir Fetch, or rather Sir Doc. Battle of fighting type Pokemon. So who's gonna move first? Me. Sir Doc is faster. Ooh. Critical hit. And that raised Sir Doc's stat. Attack stat. Hmm. Can you survive this one? Nice. Defense or speed fell. Oh boy, speed fell. Wait, speed fell. I think Bea has only one turn left for Machamp. Only one turn left for Machamp. And then after that, it will go back to its normal form. So let's use Max Guard. Hmm. What's going to be your move? G Max Cheese Strike. <laughs> nice try. Nice try. 
Now behold the power of Sir Fetch. Correction, Sir Duck. Look at that glorious duck. <laughs> bye bye, Macham. GG. GG. You've done your best. Sir Duck is also now level 35. The Fog. Nah, don't need it. Tina is now level 31. Good job, Sir Duck. Good job, good job. Knew I could count on you. I felt the fighting spirit of your Pokemon as you led them in battle. We got 11,000! Ooh! Coughing is now evolving. Yay! Galarian Wizzing! Finally have Galarian Wizzing on, uh, on my team. Good job, Coughing. You deserve this one. Wizzing, Poison Gas Pokemon Galarian form. This Pokemon consumes particles that contaminate the air. Instead of leaving droppings, it expels clean air. Hmm. Good guy Wizzing. This is the good guy Wizzing. Poison and Fairy type. Double hit. Mm, nope. Don't need double hit. We will go to the move learner later. Have you learned some fair type move? Thank you for the battle. Phew. Facing you gave me all the explanation I needed. Battling against you and your team. I hadn't expected it, but it made my heart dance. Really? It's good to be unshakable in the face of battle, but it's good to be moved by battle as well. Thank you again. Take the fighting badge. There we go. Our fourth badge. Can now catch Pokemon of up to level 40. I hope that you'll meet many more trainers and have many more matches in the future. And I hope that every one of those encounters will nourish your spirit. GG's Bea. Bea. It was nice meeting you as well. Hmm. Revenge TM. Hmm, fighting uniform. Nice. Hello? Yay, you won. Kingsred, you're so wicked. My fan. <laughs> okay. We're done here. Hmm, Bulwark. I knew it. It's gonna be Sonya and... Yamper. Looks like my Yamper really likes you, huh? Anyway, we've run into each other at a good time. You know the mural here in Stowan side? It's said to tell the story of the hero of Galar as well. So what's here, what's there today is actually a replica of the ancient art that used to be here. It tends to have surprisingly sharp insights, so I was wondering what you might think when you see the ruins. Oh, what was that? Hmm. What happened? What happened? Hold on. Before going there, I need to restore the HP of my Pokemon. We're going to follow Sonya as soon as possible. As soon as possible, but first I need. I want to see what Galarian Wizzing can learn. Hmm, remember a move. Strange Steam. Lose your attacks to target by emitting steam. This may also confuse the target. Hmm, the fog? Heat wave. Oh, wow. Yes, heat wave. This will be very useful against steel types. Easy poison gas. Fairy wind. This is just a fairy wind attack and strikes the target with it. 40. Hmm. Here's a special defense that of an ally Pokemon. 
This one is for doubles. Aromatherapy too. Interesting. But for now, let's replace Assurance with... Hmm, Heat Wave or Strange Steam? Let's go with Strange Steam. I'll just cl I'll just keep clear smog there for the meantime. It's useful against Pokemon trying to set up against squeezing. Nope, that will be it. Okay, let's see. What are wheezing stats? 100 defense, 100 HP. <laughs> nice. Anyway, good job, team. Alright, we will be following Sonia on our next episode, so stay, stay tuned and see you in the next one.